hi guys welcome back to my channel I am so happy to have you guys back in today's video I want to show you this amazing DIY studio setup design behind the scene that I created for my sister's Deuce Galore photo shoot for her bag line that is coming out and I just wanted to share the experience with you guys and how I went about putting everything together everything turned out so amazing please stay tuned towards the end of this video so you can watch the amazing final reveal hi guys welcome back to my channel and today's video is going to be pretty different from my usual video um, I've had the pleasure of designing the set for my sister's Deuce Galore Spring Bag Collection. Deuce Galore is the name of her store. She has a spring collection that will be coming out soon in March. I want to start off by giving my sister a quick shout out, giving me the honor of designing her set. Okay guys, as you can see, she just came in the shop. <laughs> I was recording in the back, so this is my little sister. She you know, a big sister. I'm gonna talk even though her. she's even though she's <laughs> tall, and I felt so honored to be able to do so. So I kind of wanted to share with you guys how I went about, you know, designing some of the pieces that I did. She, um, you will see further on in the video on how the set is going to look like. But there's a few things that I had to design that I had to put together beforehand, and I just kind of wanted to share with you guys how I went about doing that, and maybe you could pick up something from you know, this DIY that I'm about to put together for you guys today. And the theme that I am going to go for, since this is her spring bag collection, so I decided to do, you know, lots of greeneries and lots of beautiful pastel, pink, dusty colors, and with some pop of vibrant colors within the mix. So how I'm going to execute these colors, I'm going to be using these colors on the props that I am going to be using on the set that day. And some of the floors that I'm going to be using is from the flowers that you can find on my Elegant Creator Store on Amazon. This is the beautiful blush color and some beautiful white rose colors some teal colors and some pastel pink colors so i'm going to incorporate lots of those beautiful flowers from my elegant creator store and of course if you want to get your hands on these flowers guys the link will be in the description box below the decoration for her set that we're going to be going for is going to be very springy we're going to have swings we're going to have roses we're going to have greenery we're gonna have clouds. So it's gonna look really springy. So that's the look that we're going to design and decorate. So I just wanna kinda come behind the scene and kinda show you guys how I went about prepping for it and putting everything together for her shoot. So it's gonna be fun because I don't have a lot of time to decorate the shoot. I think I only have like 30 minutes to put everything together. So I'm definitely just, you know, pre-setting up now. So when I get there, I can already be done. And I'm just pretty much just putting everything together. So first thing first, I wanna share with you guys is the swing that I have right here, okay? This swing is gonna be part of the decor for her set. Let me see if I can show you the full thing right here. So this is a swing. And what I'm gonna go ahead and do is, I'm going to add greenery going along all the way down on the cord that you see here, okay? Now, how I went about putting these beautiful garlands together, I will quickly do a small demonstration on how you can do that yourself. What you will need is some eucalyptus greenery. You want to arrange them opposite sides of each other. Now, to make it full, you wanna add layers of layers of eucalyptus to get that nice full look, and then you use your floor wire to tie all of them together. You could use, of course, any colored rose you like, Take my hot glue, okay? And then hot glue my roses. You could like hot glue it however way you like. I take my, my beautiful, like the biggest rose, like let's say if you're using a bigger size rose, you wanna add that bigger size rose to the center. So that's gonna be my start point. And then after that, I just continue on with doing my beautiful flower arrangement. Just remember, it's your design. You design it however way you like. So I did about six of this beautiful garland. And once I'm done, this is how it looked. Okay. So now, how I install this beautiful greenery rose garland onto the swing is pretty simple too. So I'm going to take the cord. 
Take my greenery, my beautiful greenery you see here. And then I'm gonna use my floor wires, okay? And I'm gonna just tie it onto the swing. I'm gonna take it and overlap it onto the first one by adding it like this. And this will be my start point to where I'm going to be adding the floor wire. So I needed about three of these four garlands to complete the full look onto the rope. So I'm gonna take my third piece of floor garland and I'm going to overlap it onto the second piece like this. In total, I did about six of these floor garlands that I will be attaching to the rope. So that's how much I was able to fit um, to cover pretty much all of the rope. Okay guys, today is the big day of the photo shoot. I wanted to take you guys quickly behind the scenes so you guys could see on how the studio looks and how I'm gonna go ahead and start with designing the set. And this is basically a pretty large space, very industrial look. And this is where the photo shoot is going to be taking place in this big white space that you see here. This is where we're going to be doing all of the setup for the photo shoot. Now to start designing the set, I wanted to make sure that I measure where exactly I will be adding the swing and where it needs to be. Now I know I needed a ladder right off the back because the ceiling is pretty tall and I wanted to check to see if I was able to hang the swing myself because I am a pretty short person. I am about five foot two. Immediately as I was climbing the ladder, I realized that there would be no way that I would reach the ceiling, you know, due to the height of the ceiling. So I knew that I was going to need help putting up the swing. So that is definitely a disadvantage for when you are short, sometimes you can't reach the tallest places, even with a ladder. We were on time for everything. So we had time for errors. We had time for if anything wasn't coming out right. So the photographer was right on time and he was super helpful at following all my instructions on how to hang everything and, and on how to fix the backdrop. He was amazing and I am so thankful that he was there on set on time to help us put everything together and also following all the instruction that I needed him to do. Once 
the photographer was done putting up the swing on the ceiling, he even insisted in test trying his weight on the swing to make sure that the swing was well secured for when the models come to do their photo shoot so they do not fall. Luckily, everything turned out beautifully, guys. The colors, the swing just look absolutely amazing. The flowers are so vibrant and so beautiful. Next, we are attempting to put up the backdrop and this is the color that we're gonna go ahead and go with for the photo shoot. Pacing back and forth oh, I don't understand why you're standing right here All your shots have scored No, scratching at the scars you left on my skin We fight and we fall and we rise through it all Till we find what we want and we lose it all again Touch on my skin, pull me close, take me in Just me, just you Next, we're going to attempt to hang the clouds. That part was a bit tricky, however, we were able to pull it off. I used a fishing line to hang my clouds. I'm going to go ahead first add my string lights into my cloud so that it can light up. Then we attempted to use a duct tape to hang the clouds onto the poster backdrop. That way it was easier instead of trying to attempt hanging it from the ceiling. Okay guys, I wanted to quickly show you guys this vision poster that my sister had put together on basically how she wanted her shoot to look. And I think we did a pretty good job at putting everything together, even though you may see it look like a pretty simple set. However, there was a lot of thought process that went into this vision board so we could make her fashion bag photo shoot come to life. And it turned out absolutely beautiful, guys. So what I'm going to be showing you here is basically what I showed you on the Deuce Galore Vision poster. You will see in the Vision poster that we added a bed of roses nearby where the swing area is going to be at. This is where the models are going to be doing their shoot. So all I'm doing here, I'm just taking some flower panels, I'm adding it to the ground, I am surrounding it, positioning them right by where the swing area is and then i'm just going to design it with some beautiful roses the same pop of colors that you see in the swing is the same pop of colors i will be adding to these beautiful flower panels that's going to be laid out on the ground <laughs> And this is my little sister Sheila who is fixing her model. I forgot to mention that she also has a YouTube channel where she talk about entrepreneurship. She talks about fashion. She talk about on how you can start your business. And if this is type of content is something that you'll be interested in, definitely check her channel out. It's called Sheila the CEO. And let her know that I sent you guys here to her channel. Show some support and love if you would enjoy that type of content that she'll put out. One thing about me that I like to do is I just like to take the time to iron out any part or any details that I may have missed when I was putting the set together. I just kind of go back to do touch ups, making sure that everything looked absolutely perfect. And basically this is the finishing touch. This is just me again, just ironing out, making sure I'm not leaving any small details out, making sure everything looks perfect. The set looked absolutely beautiful. It was a success, guys. And speaking of success, success is no accident. 
it is hard work it's perseverance it's learning it's studying it's sacrificing and most of all you just have to love what you do or learning to do so i'm just really proud of my sister on how everything turned out my sister was able to have self-belief in herself and she worked hard she wanted her vision to come to life everything that she envisioned on that poster board we were able to plan everything out to make sure that it was well executed and you know because of our hard work we were able to come out with amazing accomplishments and you know there's no limit to what you can do or to what you can accomplish And as you can see, this is just the photographer pretty much just shooting the photo shoot for my sister's bag collection. And this is just a continuation on how everything turned out, on how the models look, on how the set look, on how the bags was represented on the shoot. And it was just such an amazing experience. I enjoyed every bit of it. The photographer was amazing. He was absolutely wonderful. I will put his description, all his information in the description box underneath this video if you want to contact him. He is in the, you know, Florida eastern part of Orlando. So definitely check him out if you have any type of content that you want to create with him. He is absolutely amazing and super helpful. And, you know, the experience was great, guys. And I just love how everything turned out. So guys, if you want to show some love and support and you want to put in an order for one of the bags that you see that you may have liked, feel free to check out the description box underneath this video. I will put the link to her website on if you're interested in purchasing a bag yourself. The bags they look absolutely stunning in person and it looks super high end and it's great quality bags. So definitely show some love and support if you are interested in purchasing a bag. I would truly appreciate it. You guys has been absolutely amazing thank you so much guys for watching this video throughout stay tuned and watch the end of this video so you can see the finishing result on how the photo shoot turned out so i can't wait comment below your thoughts and let me know what you guys think and i will see you guys on my next video bye guys